another shave and no, you're not confused and no, you haven't got your days mixed up. But I'll get into that. So how you doing guys, you okay? How was your weekend started, okay? I hope so, I hope it starts with a great shave. Right, what we're using. Today, I've decided to go for barbershop scent because I haven't used the barbershop scent for ages. And we'll go with Highland Springs Shaving Company Barbershop. And it's a lovely, it's a lovely barbershop scent, your, your typical barbershop scent, classic. It's nice, it's, it's, it's a very talky, it's got talky notes in it, which you can smell straight away. It's got bay rum in it, and I'm not getting a lot of bay rum. I'm not a lover of bay rum, but I would have liked a bit more bay rum in it. Patchouli, smell of patchouli, really nice green. And the sandalwood, nice sandalwood, very subtle, but very nice. And there is the ingredients. There's the pole and the colour. So that's what we're using. And I've got some spread out in my fine equipments. There. Brush. Brush I'm using is my 26mm synthetic West Coast Shaving Honeycomb. I haven't used it for a while and it's a really nice brush. So I thought I'd use that today. So pop that in the water. Right, razor. The last of the five razors that Jay Fett has loaned me, and it is the winning razor. All stainless steel. Very handsome head like. Nice weight to it. It comes in, I've made some notes, it comes in at 4.21 ounces. So it's quite a heavy weight. Got the rings there for the grip and at the bottom. Nice razor, feels well balanced. And it's made by Yates. No, it's not. Yes, it is. It's made by Yates. It's a Yates Precision Engineering. I, I think it's, it's a family, but I think it's man and wife run company. And it's made for the Wet Shaving Club. And I've been on the site as well. There's some nice razors there. Very reasonable prices as well. The only thing that bothered me with this on looking at it first um, is the lather channels. It looks very nice, very well made and positioned. I just don't know if it's going to allow much through, being so small. Blade in there today is the Voskod. Second juice, Teflon coated, because I really, really enjoyed it last time I used it, so I'm going to use it again to show you the head, head cap. There it is, you can see the machined markings, the tool marks if you like, beautiful. Now the blade gap in this is 0 0.20, so it's quite mild. Where's the washer gone? Actually, I'm going to show you something I found out about this and I didn't know. If you put your blade down or drop it, There you go. Well, that's quite handy. Saves you fiddling and possibly cutting yourself trying to pick the blade up. So, uh, screw that back on. That's not lined. Shouldn't have took the blade out should I because it was seated. There you go. No overhang to worry about, so I'm happy about that. Right. Three flicks of the brush and swept them off dripping and let's get lathering. And I'll fill you in what happened on Friday. Now these are thirsty soaps as well by the way. So you're gonna have to keep dipping the tips and adding a bit more aqua. Was it aqua? <laughs> anyway, yeah, Thursday. Really looking for it. And I've changed my mind about the shave because I'd already done the pippy shave and uh, done the thumbnail. Sorry, I'm trying to get one of the wife's hairs off the sink. I, I don't want to go in the sink. I picked the shave, done the thumbnail and everything, and I was ready to rock and roll. Nice hot shower. 
even though it was absolutely roasting, scorching, humid. Weather's been uh, okay apart from the last couple of days, but it's been really humid and dull. We've had rain, we had a bit of a storm Thursday night, which is part of the reason why there was no, uh, no video. Anyway, got out the shower, got dressed and everything set up. I was just about to start the shave and switch that camera on. Bang, power went out. We had no power whatsoever. And it wasn't just us, because I checked all the circuit boards, went outside, the uh, the one street light we've got outside for the four, well, the few houses that, were, that are here, was out. Power cut. And it didn't come back on apparently until two o'clock Friday morning. Tree come down across the power lines. So nobody, the village was without power for a few hours. So it was an early night. Early night to bed, no YouTube, no video, no download, nothing great. So that was the reason for no video on Friday. And thank you to uh, John 101, John Shaves 101, Craig Will, Mark Backwell as well for your concerns and touching base with me to see if everything was all right. I really appreciate that. Thank you very much. So, yeah. Well, thank you very much. But that's all it was. It was a power cut. <laughs> Typical me living with sticks. <coughs> right. That's ready to go, guys. Look at that. Hey, wet the mush. Got the water out. Yeah, the, the, I had a look on the site of these razors and uh, very reasonably priced for the look at all stainless steel razors. Some nice razors there. It's obviously a mild razor and I've obviously got an extra day's growth. So we'll see how it copes. Give it a proper test. Oh wow, this feels nice. It's sent strength out the pork, I would say it's about a medium, about a five. Maybe a five and a half now it's leather. Feels nice on the skin. Yeah, and thank you so much, Jay, for lo loaning me the five raises. It's been absolutely great trying them all out. I may purchase a couple, but not just yet. Maybe a bit, a bit closer towards Christmas. All right, here we go, guys. The winning razor. Let's give it a go. Oscott, second use. Straight away blade angle is there for you with the design. Didn't even have to think about that. And that is a fantastic blade combination with this. Lather channels with my concern. Doesn't seem to be a problem. Actually. An almost dragon feeling. I hope the blade's all right. Wow. I can actually feel the blade, there's a nice blade feel on it. It's not overly aggressive or anything like that. I thought it would be a really, I mean, look at the blade gap. I thought it'd be really mild. That is nice, I really like that. I mean, if I remember correctly, I think this was about forty, forty-four dollars, something like that. Reminds me of the quality of Razorock 
for the price. Exceptional value. Yeah, it's a strange feeling now that the growth is gone. It's an almost dragging feeling, but it's not. That is really nice. I'm gonna have to get one of these, I think. Like I said, it's very handsome like head. The balance feels great. That's a great first pass. That's nice. So what's your plans for the weekend, guys? I don't plan on doing a great deal today. I have a few notes to write down for the shaving, non-shaving, or the non-shaving, shaving video, for the razor burn. And a few people have requested. So I'm hoping that will be up tomorrow. Maybe a short video, just covering the basics sharing with you guys what I've learned and if there's anybody new to the channel welcome you're amongst good friends second pass guys across the grove I know what it is it's not dragging it can't drag now on the second pass It feels like the razor is sucking to the skin. That must be the design. It could be um, because of the lather channels as well. Yeah, it's, there's like a suck, a suction feeling with the razor. I think that's a good thing because it, it's keeping it really close to the skin. Well, that's nice guys. I'll put a link in the description to everything that I use where I can. If you want to take a look for yourselves, you're welcome. The soap I got from Shaving Time, if you fancy the soap. And if you do, use my code, my discount code, it's CB4089. I'll put it in the description. If you use that code at the checkout, you'll get 10% off anything that you buy. This is really nice. This is a really comfortable shape. I was really surprised with this razor. Pleasantly surprised. Still got that thing there, look. Like a little scare. I mean, it's healed, it's just left a mark. Wow! That second pass, that is excellent. So it's performing well. It's got the a nice, it's not massive, but it's there, the slickness is there to do the job. That nice feel on the skin. 
soaps are performing well. It's delivering. Put this one a bit thinner. Here we go, guys, against the growth third pass. Nice feedback. You hear that? I hope so. Wow. It gives you confidence, this razor. Although you've got to treat every razor with respect, obviously, because of the blade. Same wow, I'm impressed for the price. I mean, don't quote me, I think they're based in California, but don't quote me on that because I read that much stuff, <laughs> that much stuff in my head, everything gets mixed up. Great against the growth on the lip. Not aggressive whatsoever. But you can, you've got that blade feel, but it's not threatening. Get the slipness on that. As you can see the slipness works no problem. It's the old usual suspects for the pickups under the jawline, middle of the neck where it grows like a star. Fantastic combination with the blade. Why do I like boss cuts? That is beautiful. That is a great shave. Water rinse and use the arm block. Let the arm block. Very slight, very slight zing. Very nice. I love the zing though. We should feel alive. Fresh towel, thanks, Mrs. B. Appreciate it as always. Oh, 
That is a great shave. Again. No irritation, no redness. Just a great finish. After shave. Matching after shave. Barbershop. It's got the ingredients on the back, I think so. Is that focusing? I don't know because my eyes aren't focused. Milky substance. Got some nice ingredients in it. Same as the soap with the skin. Nice properties. That's beautiful. That's nice. She classic musky talky barbershop scent. Beautiful. Right, bomb. Seeing it's a tad humid and warm, I'm gonna go for Arco Cool today. I like the Arco. Excuse you. Oh, that's all you need. Good thing. Goes a long way. Slight sense that that's a good combination, goes well with the aftershave though. Wow, that's the shave guys, thank you so much for joining me. Feels weird on a Saturday. <laughs> right, the winning razor. Take a look guys. <laughs> I've never heard of them. Uh, Yates Precision, family owned business, fantastic job, beautiful, and it's got the added bonus of the magnet for your, for your blade, very impressed, that's it guys, thanks Jay, once again, I'll be in touch for your address mate so I can send them back to you, right, um, if you're new to the channel, welcome, as I said before, hit that subscribe button and join the new subscribers that I've had over the last few days, few days, few days. Thanks, guys, for jumping on board and supporting the channel. I really appreciate it. Have a fantastic weekend, guys, and have some great shaves. Might see you tomorrow. Um, if not, have a great weekend. Have fun and stay safe. See you, guys. Bye now.